Apparently, dude, what is this? Okay, so we've still got our floppy setup going on here where we're capturing flux traces from a three and a half inch floppy drive, but I've replaced the Feather M4 SAMD51 with this pink feather, not just because pink is a cool color, but because this feather has an RP2040 on it, which is a low cost chip from the Raspberry Pi Foundation. And this chip can run really fast. It also has this cool PIO uh, peripheral. So we're overclocking it to 200 megahertz, but why not? We're getting good uh, flux captures over here. And uh, when we recompiled it and we're running a grease weasel, it's just working. So this is cool because now I've got two different platforms that work with this Arduino library, which is the goal to make it hardware agnostic so more people can um, wire up hardware and build hardware to work with floppy disk drives. And then next up, maybe we'll try this little fellow, the Raspberry Pi Pico, $4 microcontroller board.